The man who is now charged with killing his missing wife in Chafee County was in court this morning for the first time. Suzanne Morphew was last seen on Mother's Day a year ago. Now nearly a year later, her husband is charged with first degree murder. Nine News reporter Mark Salinger joins us live from Salida and he was in the courtroom this morning. Mark. Yeah, Barry Morphew said few words in court this morning, only responding to the judge with yes or no answers. As he faces murder charges, his wife is still missing. Suzanne Morphew has been missing for nearly a year. For all that time, her husband Barry has maintained his innocence. Today he appeared in court for the first time charged with killing her. Wearing a Chafee County jail jumpsuit and restraints around his wrists and ankles, he sat mostly silent. Morphew's daughters were also in court, crying at times. As he walked out, one made a heart with her hands and seemed to mouth, I love you as she pulled down her mask. The judge did not allow audio to be recorded in the courtroom or video of the Morphew daughters. As they deal with these unimaginable circumstances, their faces and names will not be shown on our air. This has been a very thorough investigation even up to this point. There's been, I think, over 400 search warrants. It's been going on for a year. We still know very little about what evidence investigators have that led deputies to arrest Morphew and charge him with murder. Nine News legal analyst and MSU Denver professor Whitney Trailer says he's not surprised investigators are keeping their evidence sealed. In a situation like this, when they don't release the information at this stage, it's probably because they believe it will impact the integrity of the investigation. At a press conference Wednesday, District Attorney Linda Stanley declined to say why she felt comfortable charging Morphew, but urged the public she's confident in his guilt. That's my job. I'm the one that considers how strong my case is before I bring charges, and I wouldn't bring charges unless. I was confident. The fact that they arrested him and they plan to bring formal charges, the DA must be confident. Morphew will be in court again at the end of the month. He remains in custody without bail. And again, Suzanne Morphew is still missing, and investigators are not saying if they have any leads on where her body might be. Barry Morphew is also charged with attempting to influence a public official and tampering with physical evidence. Tom and Kim. The timing coincidental, but it's been one year when you think about it. Come up on Mother's Day again. All right. Thank you, Mark.